Yo, what's up, guys? In today's video, we have the bloody Joker. So, let's get into it. Alright, so starting off, just have the box comes in, just picture on him. Him. Yeah. So, I don't want to talk about the box, so let's get into the figure. And let's just cut the box piece to it. Got it. Got it. Alrighty. Pop him open. Knife. Come back here, knife. His cane. And him. Here he is. Looking real nice. So, now I will say the Joker has one of the figures that has the worst articulation, in my opinion. Like, this guy's not even wanting to move, I'm telling you. They have to go heat up his joints or something, because this guy's trying to be real stiff on me. But, yeah. Alrighty, so taking a look at the figure. Real good attention to detail. Like that smile, just menacing. Mm -hmm. The focus. I just menacing. This guy looks like he's just going crazy with the blood on the mouth and the real big smile. And he got blood in his green shirt going up to the purple vest. I don't know why they felt the need to add a flower. It just looks out of context. But then. The knee can bend. Put me back up. Yeah. Bend all the way back like that. Just gotta push it a little bit. Pull it back out. So yeah, looks really good. The elbows not wanting to move. Yeah, they can just real stiff. Which looks really good. Got the flap in the back. Go up like that. It's a really good figure. Oh, since taking a look at the accessories, he has his knife. Right here. With the blood on it. Which looks really good. So this thing looks awesome. Then you got his cane with the blood on it. Looks really good. They do a really good job with these figures. They really do. So, that series look good. So next up for the articulation. Start off with the head. His head can kind of rocks a little bit. There's no real articulation there. It's just really stiff. Go up and down a little bit. It's more on a rocker, I would say, because like you, it's really not turning like it's on a ball, just a little bit. But and this guy, and he can go about that far. I don't want to force it anymore. Looks like there's some sort of lip right there that stops him from going any farther up. So about just under 90 degree bend. I don't think that's a full 90 degrees yet. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think it's full 90 degrees yet. And then the bicep up here has got a swivel to where you can turn it like that. Surprise, you got that. Wrist. Rocking up and down. And rocking side to side. And it can kind of turn. Oh, yeah, I can turn. Sorry, this is so stiff. It's hard to get it to turn. Yeah, I can turn like that. Waist up, down, side to side a little bit. Legs can go into a pretty good front kick and a pretty good side kick. Knees can yeah yeah this is all I can get the knee to go up 
sorry about that. Just under 90 degrees. I'm positive it's under 90 degrees. So the knee's got pretty bad articulation. At least on that knee it does. The other knee, it's gonna go up like this. So one of them I think is stiffer than the other one. I mean, I'm not gonna push it, but the other knee can go up like this. Ankle turns all the way around. Toe goes up like that to the, to the toe joint. Ankle can rock side to side. Up and down. Yeah, it looks, heels looks really good. He also comes with his base. Standard Mortal Kombat base. Oh, I thought I was able to get him in a quick pose. Cane up, knife kind of drawn to the chin on his base. So yeah, he can pose pretty well. Alrighty, so thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you guys next one. Bye.